Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, it is going to be our wash day for both me and Olivia. So in the first part of the video, we're going to do Olivia's hair and these are the products that I'm going to be using on her. Um, so I've got a Kroger bag because I don't have any plastic hats. And this is what I'm going to put over the Kroger bag to keep it from sliding off and to help generate heat as she moves around because I'm not going to stick her under the dryer. The dryer that I have, um, it's not a, a stand-up hair dryer. It's kind of one of those ones where it's got the bag and then the long tube in the back. So the tube gets really, really hot and it burns um, when it's on your skin and stuff. Um, even if you put a towel, it does still get hot. But... So we're not using that, so I'm going to let her just kind of walk around and do what she does to generate her heat, um, to generate heat through her scalp as she is deep conditioning. Um, so anyway, <laughs> the other product that we're going to use for her comb out, because um, I am going to detangle her hair, she is still natural, you guys. So I'm just going to use this. I had this in the bathroom, and this is the... Talia Wajid Curls Waves Naturals. It's a detangler. It's really, a, well, it's a detangler, but it's a leave-in conditioner and co-wash. But I'm just going to use it to detangle her hair before I shampoo it. And she's got a little bit of dandruff, so I'm going to use this dandruff shampoo. Um, but what I'm going to do is mix it with this moisturizing shampoo and detangler, and that's how we're going to do that. For her deep conditioner, I'm going to use this olive oil deep conditioner. So I've used this on my hair before and I like it. Um, this, I have not had a chance to use it yet. So this will actually be the first time that we're going to be using this since I purchased it. And it's the African Pride Olive Miracle Anti-Breakage Formula. So it's sulfate-free and, co sulfate and color-safe. Um, it's moisturizing and detangling, two-in-one shampoo. And let's see... It has olive and tea tree oils in there so um, there's no sulfates no mineral mineral oil no parabens and no glutens um, if you guys are familiar with how they used to look then that's how they used to look they changed the packaging but anyway this is the deep conditioner by organics African best and the leave-in conditioner um, by African pride olive miracle anti-breakage formula so those are the items that we're going to be using on her hair today. And I always wash her hair in the sink. So I sanitize my sink. Um, I have been cooking today. I made lasagna. But I sanitize my sink prior to washing her hair and mine. And I always use just regular dish liquid soap. Um, so I happen to have Dawn on hand. And I always use a antibacterial. Um, so if the Dawn liquid soap or whatever dish detergent that I'm using isn't already antibacterial, then that's when I go in with the spray or some sort of antibacterial spray. So this is what I have on hand, and this is what I'm going to be using to clean in my sink. So let's get into getting her hair together.
okay so it's time to style Olivia's hair and she is wanting to wear it straight more so what we did was to minimize the heat we just let it air dry for two days and now we're gonna press it out her press outs don't last that long so we're gonna do a little bit of heat training and press it out this time since it's been a while since we pressed it out the last time um, she hasn't been wearing any braids in a while she's been wearing her hair out and she is completely natural she doesn't have any chemicals any color or anything in her hair um, her hair may look dry on the camera but it is moisturized um, I put some leave-in conditioner in it um, as you guys saw that and so these are the tools we're going to be using for her hair we've got some combs a brush the flat iron that I'm using is the H2, H2 Pro Silk this is the titanium one and this is the ceramic H2 Pro and I've got some clips and we're going to just use light heat for the blow dryer to kind of stretch her hair a little bit but before that I am going to put a little bit of this foam wrap lotion and um, a little bit of this oil moisturizer lotion to as heat protectants and to kind of help um, with the detangling process before I start to blow dry.
Thank you.